The chatbot development for this task required a data set. So we built one from the ground up into a database. 1,227 screen names assigned. The corpus grew to more than 803,000 messages. We mapped 1,172 dialogues with nearly 5,000 lines of conversations. Each conversation was labeled risky or not. Additionally, each speaker and conversation had their own unique ID number assigned to them. Overall, the data held flags such as perp versus victim, male or female, or the level of line risk for future sentiment analysis. The team developed three different test environments of Python to build a chatbot. More than 2,500 lines of code was written with 657 lines in the chatbot alone. More than three weeks focused on upgrading or trying out new codes. The main goal was to be self-contained and be offline to avoid technical dependencies. Here the chatbot attempts to respond to my input. Depending on the batch run, I would have more results. The chatbot's output would be paired with a small program to determine if the conversation was risky or not. For example, here Alpha Kid is having a conversation with someone new. That person is asking to meet up with her and get her address. Watch how the warnings of the chat are added into the conversation.